Well, it's, uh, we got some, some bad news. Bad news. Good morning vlog. It's another rainy day here in Ottawa and Tina and I, well, guess where we're going first thing. Guess. We're leaving the cat cafe. I ain't too happy about it, but we gotta go home at some point. Yeah, we'll be back. Um, we'll never be back. We're done. This is the last day. <laughs> Tina's is so sad. Oh. She really loves this Mimi cat. She wants to adopt Mimi, but. We don't have a proper place for the kitties. It's too soon. He loves us. Hi. He wants to play. I'm pretty sure they even made the bagel fresh. So good. Hey guys, well, it's, uh, we got some, some bad news slash good news. I guess it depends on how you look at it. We're cutting vacation short. We're done. We're, we've had enough. So we're gonna go home and we're gonna enjoy Chatham. I think this gives us a new appreciation on Chatham definitely and we're just excited to get back and eat our secure sushi and <laughs> sleep in our bed. Peace out, Ottawa. Peace out, Montreal. You were good while it lasted. Honestly, this whole trip, we kind of didn't really have a plan um, at all. <laughs> but <laughs> thankfully, like we went into Montreal with no plan and we found a bunch of cool stuff to do. And we also found like a ton of vegan restaurants. I guess it is what you make it at the end of the day. And I guess we just don't have the energy to make it awesome anymore, man. Like. It's just, we're tired, we wanna go home, home. We'll be back when we have van life and we'll definitely explore the nature because the nature is absolutely beautiful. In reality, we were hoping to have our whole van situation figured out by the time we left for vacation. Unfortunately, as you know, that was not the case. We couldn't get the van in time. Uh, we couldn't get the van at all. But. And so we decided, okay, hotel rooms are expensive. Let's check out some Airbnbs. And like, it was kind of cool. But at the same time, the it wore the coolness wore off fast because it was like, I don't know, I just didn't feel like I was at home. I was at somebody else's home. And it was just like, I don't know, that's the whole point. That's the most beautiful thing about van life, living in a van, is like you're home all the time. Like wherever you are, you get to be yeah. home. And I just, maybe I'm just a homebody and mm -hmm. I just love my home too much. But I, being away from that for however long, it gets exhausting. It's just tiring. So it's gonna be good to go back home for sure. Bye. All right, so we got a long road trip ahead of us, a guys. Flong? A flong road trip. Look, so we got our Starbucks. Also, we didn't really leave Ottawa until like 4 p.m., meaning we're not gonna get home till hopefully midnight, <laughs> but like to be more realistic, probably like 2 a.m. You guys remember our vlog on the way in. It was insane, man. We actually ended up having like a four hour delay. God! Like. We made it home, what up, what up, what up? And I'm so pumped because I'm about to play some music. We just got settled in, we just got chilled. We're pretty pumped. Tina's we, inspired. We're not chill, we're inspired. <laughs> Yeah, she's this got it right. Chill. This is not chill. Uh, it's I've been away from this for too long. Yes, I'm so excited I to get agree. back at it. I miss this, man. This is my life.